I would like to send a warm hello to everyone who has returned to watch another video on our channel. Forget about Simone Biles becoming the most decorated lady gymnast in history. Too often, the conversation swings away from her exceptional skills to focus on her tightly coiled hair. From the moment the gymnast debuted into the national stage in 2016 to her wedding images in April 2023, she endured criticism from many other black women for her untamed edges, reiterating the critique that her kinky hair didn't adhere to European beauty standards. The reality is the assessment of her afro-textured hair often overshadows the athlete's abilities. Once Biles tweeted a picture of herself in a cheerleader costume, and instead of people applauding her exploring her newfound love of cheering with the Houston Texans, an honorary team slot, people zoomed in on her textured hair, which sweated out from hours of practice. But at 27, as the oldest American woman gymnast to compete in the Olympics in the past 72 years, and one of just four American women in gymnastics history to go to the Olympics three times, Biles is no longer embarrassed by it. In a recent interview with Elle, she stated she's accepted her hair and has learned to manage it, gaining confidence in her appearance as she identified the correct hair care for herself. Nobody taught me how to do my hair, she says. I always went to the professionals. She added that while she now loves her hair, in the past, it has been the source of enormous anguish. From an early age, Biles has been training intensely, leaving little time for hair care. While other black girls were learning to braid and style their hair, Biles was perfecting somersaults. Adopted by her grandparents, Ronald and Nellie Biles, the latter of whom regularly took on the chore of styling her hair. A point highlighted in the Netflix documentary, Simone Biles, Rising. Nellie recounted the significance of this pattern, notably the heartbreaking time at the Tokyo Olympics when Biles withdrew from numerous competitions, probably influenced by the lack of this regular ritual. Tokyo was the one time I did not braid Simone's hair, Nellie remarked in the documentary. She is an adult. I mean this girl can braid her hair, but it's not about her braiding her hair. It's that bonding. It's that not saying much. It's the touch. Biles endured external criticism on her appearance, similar to that faced by other black gymnasts like Gabby Douglas. Social media users have voiced their understanding of this pressure. One person wrote, Watching the Simone Biles, rising doc, so good. Betty and Dominique tell it straight up how their dark, kinky hair wasn't acceptable. The 2012 clips are on and Gabby is there crushing it, and I immediately get emotional. I'll never forget how the world treated her. Watching the Simone Biles, rising doc, really fantastic. Betty and Dominique tell it straight up how their dark, kinky hair wasn't acceptable. The 2012 clips are on and Gabby is there crushing it, and I immediately get emotional. I'll never forget how the world treated her. Another added, watching Simone Biles' documentary, and I'm crying. When her mom is braiding her hair before Worlds, she comments, I've braided her before every meet except Tokyo. She's 26 years old, she doesn't require me to do her hair, it's about the silent bonding. Outside the gymnastics ring, Biles has also suffered opposition from her own community. She says, I don't really care if my edges aren't smooth. Her wedding images, revealed in April 2023, prompted caustic comments regarding her hair. Simone Biles wild aff for taking her wedding pictures with her hair like that. Y'all can fight me down, I am care. I stand on what I said. One naysayer tweeted, Explain to me exactly what's wrong with Simone Biles' edges in her wedding photographs. Lympha hell. Y'all are insane father she's supposed to have Europe edges coming out her Afrisier scalp. Sphew. Y'all the reason Gabby Douglas started wearing them enormous wigs with no parting space. In a now-deleted tweet, another said, It's Simone Biles' hair was a mess for her wedding day, y'all not convincing me that is a bride look. Many rallied to her defense, praising her achievements and resilience. Simone Biles is one of DE top gymnasts we've ever seen, has overcome situations of abuse and other obstacles in her childhood, has defined her own success and found love, and is now happily married. And y'all worry about her hair. One person tweeted, Biles herself reacted, stressing the problems of maintaining her hairstyle in Texas humidity. I think they also forget I live in HUS and TXS and I sweat those out. 
soon as we walk outside for photographs but they can keep moaning ick ick it. I think they also forget I live in H.U. Westo in Texas and I sweat those out. Soon as we step outdoors for photographs, but they may keep complaining ick ick ick. Media critic Michaela Angela Davis broke down the aura surrounding black girls and their hair in the community. Wherever there's a black girl, there's a hair conversation, she stated, according to Anscape. To a conservative black audience, this is the point where respectability politics kicks in. It activates something in them that says, if you're not really pulled together, or if you are a young black girl with unkempt hair, that suggests you aren't loved or something just isn't right. Today, Biles employs social media to learn about hair care, accessing videos and products that suit her hair type. We've been able to take care of our hair better and take care of our beauty routines better because it's self-taught, she told Elle. It's really special that we have access to those platforms. Understanding hair, a topic she previously faced criticism for, has provided profound benefits that have been challenging to express, particularly as a black female athlete who spent most of her career thrust into a public discourse that scrutinizes her beauty and indirectly, her person and background. I'm finally learning to love my hair and the texture that I have and the styles that I can do, Biles added. She said, I never thought about my hair like the way other people see it. In the gymnastics world, homogeneity and look is the rule. Female gymnasts generally flaunt sleek ponytails, a look that can be tough for black females to attain without extensions. According to the USA Gymnastics Women's Program, 2020-2021 Rules and Policies, hair is secured away from the face so as to not obscure her vision of the apparatus. Biles said she is blessed to have Jordan Chells, an Afro-Latina, as a colleague who can help her with her braids. I used to worry about my hair being considered not professional, she admits, but I'm not embarrassed about it anymore. With improved confidence, a solid hair care routine, and the camaraderie of a largely women of color crew offering emotional and hair care support, Paris promises to be a terrific experience for Biles. Olympic gold champion Simone Biles took to social media to clock all the people who assume that she is bothered by her husband's quip after he labeled himself the catch in their relationship and the sneaky connotation that she is not his type. Biles and her husband Jonathan Owen's appearance on the Pivot podcast has had social media talking. The Green Bay Packers safety presented a funny description of how they met, admitting that his wife sought him. In one segment of the interview, one host, Channing Crowder, pushes a story that Owens didn't want to date Biles, who at the time he didn't realize she was the world's most accomplished gymnast. He said after the two met on a dating service, she was aggressive in her pursuit of him. According to Owens, the former Houston Texans star was reluctant to rush into a serious relationship because he was so new in the NFL and was a bachelor at the time. He suggested that he was unsure about giving up his single life. Love prevailed, and once the two united, the rest was history. As the discourse progressed, Biles queried those on X in a fury about her love life. Are y'all done yet? On December 23. In a follow-up remark, which has since been deleted, the star athlete shouted on social media, y'all want me to be insecure. Biles disclosed more about their connection during Peacock's 2023 back that year up with Kevin Hart and Kenan Thompson. When asked in this week's show, who is the greater athlete, she replied, I think we're good at our own sports. She said considering difficulty and ability. Gymnastics is harder, whether he agrees or not. I know your name, replied Thompson, alluding to Alan's assertion that he didn't know who she was before they began dating. Hart then wanted to backtrack as he probed about the disputes and furious disagreements being held in the Owens household, asking who is the superior athlete. We fought over it a couple times and then we vowed once we got married we wouldn't talk about it again. But it keeps coming up every time, Biles explained. He has done my workout in the gym and he could barely do it. However, when it came to complete his NFL workout, she crushed it. 